Good morning, pupils. How are you? I hope you have been doing your assignment. You go to the assignment portal and do all the assignment there. Immediately you finish doing it, submit it through the, the website. I will go there and mark it. Now, this is our third day of the topic capacity and weight. Now, our next topic is on weight, part three. And under weight, we are going to look into conversion. Conversion of kilogram to grams and grams to kilograms. Now, at the end of this lesson, you are going to identify the unit of measurement in weight. Define capacity. Convert kilograms to grams and grams to kilograms. Convert kilograms to ton and ton to kilograms. Remember in our previous lesson, I told you the unit of measurement in capacity. And I told you that the unit of measurement in capacity is liters. And some of the objects that we can use to measure capacity. I told you we can use bucket, we can use bottle, we can use tank, and so on. Then, In this weight, weight means how heavy or light an object is. It is measured in grams. Gram, it, grams is, a gram is used to measure very small objects like sachet of tea, tin of milk, kilograms. Kilogram is used to measure bigger objects like bag of rice, bags of corn, and so on. White ton is used to measure biggest objects like car, cars, lorries, train, and so on and so forth. And the unit of measurement in weight is grams grams, kilograms, ton, and so on. These are the units of measurement. Remember, in the school, the first week of resumption, we used to bring weighing balance in the class, scale. We call it scale in the class. And each and every one of you, we climb on it. We check your weight and know how heavy or light you are. Then we note down in your result booklet. So you know the instrument we use to measure weight is called weighing balance or scale. Now the table of measurement in weight. We have 10 milligrams equals to one centigram. 10 centigrams equals to one decigram. 10 decigrams grams equals to 1 grams. 1,000 grams equals to 1 kilograms. 1,000 kilograms equals to 1 ton, and so on. Then 1,000 centimeter cube equals to 1 liter, which is the same thing as 1 kilograms, which is the same thing as 1,000 grams, which is the same thing as 1,000 milli liters. Example, change the following. Number one, 3.261 kg to grams. Number two, 5,726 grams to kilograms. Three, nine grams to kilograms. Four, nine whole number three over four tons to kilograms. 
and then solution one kilogram equals to one thousand grams three kg equals to three thousand grams plus two hundred and sixty one grams because two hundred and sixty one is already in grams so you add it to three thousand grams we have three thousand two hundred and sixty one grams then number two one thousand grams equals to one kg five thousand seven hundred and twenty six grams equals to question mark we cross multiply we have five thousand seven hundred and twenty six grams times one kg everything over one thousand grams go with grams we have five point seven two six kilograms number three one thousand grams equals to one kg nine grams equals to question my cross multiply we have nine grams times one kg everything over one thousand grams goes with grams so we have zero point that is nine divided by one thousand kg we give you zero point zero zero nine kg number four one ton equals to one thousand kilograms nine ton we also give you nine thousand kilograms then number four one ton equals to one thousand kilograms nine ton equals to nine thousand kilograms then we come to the second aspect of it because they say nine whole number three over four so we find three over four tons to kilograms so we have ton to kilograms so we have three over four times one thousand kilo one thousand kilograms so we have 750 kilograms so we have 9000 kg kilograms plus 750 kilogram equals to 9750 kilogram not gram because we are asked to change to kilogram so we have 9750 kilogram take note of it kilogram not grams then we uh, uh, then bring out your class exercise book and copy the all the uh, uh, all the examples and if you have question ask me through the website then your assignment is write the following number one eight kg to grams number two 0.246 kg to grams number three four thousand three hundred grams to kg number four seventy two grams to kg number five two thousand five hundred kg to tons number six five tons to kilograms now equally go to the website check on the assignment side do all the assignments that side and submit it that side i will mark them whenever you finish then the date of submission is inside that place thank you and god bless you have a wonderful day